Hi everyone and welcome along to today's video which I'm doing kind of up on my roof which is where this camera is going to be going just to kind of use it as a view cam today although obviously it's a security camera so I turn around and take a look at it I've already screwed it up here it is and it's in position where I want it just so I can give you a really good view with this security camera so we're back down on the ground in the kitchen this camera from Rio Link this model super high definition model this is the 822a and this one quotes a really high specification of 4k and 8 megapixel that means the definition of this camera is way beyond any of the others that are pro probably previously done actually yep it's got to be the best <laughs> other highlights of this camera night vision 100 feet that's pretty terrific as well one other really good thing i like is the zoom yes there was a free time zoom on this one we'll go to the settings on the camera now and all the usual things um, motion detection uh, i like again we've got the sensitivity that we can have here so you can actually set that i've got it set to medium at the moment so that's pretty good we go back We've also got motion zones, that's there. And you can see the view from up on my roof there at the moment. It's a miserable day out there today. But uh, you can zone off areas, as you can see, just by pushing your finger around. That's a great idea. You don't want too many false alerts. Okay, we've got camera recording. It's off, obviously, at the moment, because I don't actually want it on. But uh, you can do that, and you get these other nice things up here if you want an SD card in this camera then you can overwrite it so when it's full up it will start again in the beginning which is great and obviously that post motion recording duration which is very good and also set it up for scheduled times also we can set up for the usual push notifications there email alerts and share the camera with other members of the family what have you a good one is this time lapse I had this on one of the other cameras. I think it's a great little idea there, isn't it? <laughs> I'll probably do that with the, the one I've got up on the roof there. Looks good. Right, lastly, the thing to note, just before I show you some PC images and film, is that this is a POE camera, which stands for Power Over the Ethnet. So you've got to plug this camera in with a cable that goes to your router and that also supplies the power. You do need a little power supply divider to do that as well, to give it the power over the Ethernet. There's my one down there, just plugged in all those other plugs. And basically it just connects between the router, goes through that little box there, which is very cheap. And you just connect the routed wire back into your camera. Right, I've now got the app up on my computer screen. It's much better and easier visual than on the phone, but I realise most of you probably will be using phones. Just one other thing I wanted to show you on here, and this is the alarm, the alarm settings on here. You can see it's set for any motion, but you can also set it up for just person detection, or vehicle, or all three. You can tick the box, which is very handy. You don't want to wear false alarms, and you just want to pick a person up, or someone maybe trying to steal your vehicle. Great idea, I think. Well, it's a pretty miserable day out there today, so I'm going to switch to some things I took earlier in the week when the weather was much better. Well, that's about it. Thanks very much for watching it, guys. And as you can guess, I really like this camera. <laughs> Fantastic. So, I'll keep them coming because home security is something very important to us all, isn't it? So, all my stuff, you know where to go. Derriton 33. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.